Hey guys, um, I just wanted to get on here and film a um, an actual breathwork session and how it how it works and what it is, and um, show you guys what it's all about. So breathwork's one of the most amazing ways that you can like heal everything physically, mentally, emotionally. And um, all you do is you literally breathe as much as you can, two breaths in, one breath out, that's kind of a half breath, and you keep going until you are <laughs> just vibrating and moving and just, you know, like detoxing and like basically peeling back the layers around your heart, around traumas, around wounds that you have. And as you go through this process, you become more and more aligned with your self, your real self, your authentic self. And fear goes away, anxiety goes away, stress goes away, and you just are clear. So it's actually, um, right now it's later on in the afternoon, but this is, my, this is the first thing I do every single morning after getting some water. I wake up, I get some water, and I go right to my little breath workstation. And I'm just going to show you guys for fun. Lots of fun. Um, the breath workstation that I have. So it's really simple. Um, I don't know if you guys can see that. It's just literally, like I put some crystals around. Get my amethyst there. And I make a little, like, there's the last one, crystal grid. That's just, if you're into that stuff, you don't have to do that. That helps uh, me be in touch with my guides and communicate with, you know, um, my higher self, it just helps me be more clear and get those messages that I need. Um, <clears throat> and yeah, you want to do it from like 30 to 40 minutes. And then you just, you just, you go into this different world. And if you start your day off like this, it's like, it's next level. So it's <laughs> profoundly game changing for me. It's one of the, the most important practices that I do to this day, every single day in order to move forward in my life because you get the clarity and the insights that you need to make the most important changes and to heal and to find yourself every single morning. And that's super important. So that being said, I'm just gonna show you guys <clears throat> what it actually looks like and how to do it. So we're gonna get the film just right here so I want you guys to see everything that I'm doing okay and no sure it does not have to be off but you know this is this is me in my fullest vulnerable state here about what I actually do all right so all you do you lay down it's important to have a flat surface okay you want to be on the ground completely flat <clears throat> one hand on the lower abdomen down here, one hand on the heart, just like this. <clears throat> okay. <sighs> and then you really, the cool thing about it is there's no special techniques. There's no like have to be perfect or intuitive or anything like that. You just go for it. <laughs> you just go for it and you see what happens. Okay. So here's how it works. You lay down one hand here, one hand here. <sighs> So that's a, just a little sample of it. And I gave you guys, the reason I kept going was because I actually felt even in that little stint, I felt 
the emotions or whatever wanted to come up, come up today start to come up. And what's interesting about this whole thing is for me right now, I don't know if you guys could see it, there was a moment in that where the fear that I was feeling about expressing this video to the public and being seen in this kind of, kind of light um, really was coming up. And then as I breathe into that, that's the whole key is you breathe into that fear, you breathe into that vulnerability, and you discover the truth on the other side, right? So the truth on the other side of that journey for me was actually, wait, this is going to inspire people and the people need to see this and hear this and, and you're going to, you're, you're going to come out and help people with this, right? And that was stronger than the fear I felt about even doing it. But I only got to that place because I breathed into those spaces. So it's really important because breath is the thing that will take us emotionally and the internal world to the other side. And if we don't use breath or if we don't, if, if we don't consciously do something about these emotions, we're going to stay stuck and stagnant and oppressed by our fear as opposed to exploring and conquering it and going to the other side. Okay. Um, so didn't feel inclined to do a full breathwork session. I've already done a little bit of breathwork this morning and just had this random inspiration to show you guys for whatever reason. So just know, you know, this is a tool. That's a very, very valuable tool. That's all you do. It's super simple. You get on the floor. If you have crystals, great. If not, that's totally cool. I've never used crystals. Um, <clears throat> and you just breathe two breaths in, right? One to the lower diaphragm here second into the chest it's going to be a little tighter but really breathing into both and then letting go naturally don't force anything don't try and speed things up just and then let it go and even if you do it wrong if you just keep going you're going to have some profound emotional releases you're going to have some profound realizations and, and your day is going to be completely different it's one of the most incredible tools that i've ever i still to this day i've been using so um and then the crystals too, just figured I'd throw this in if you guys are curious. The crystals for me, uh, you know, I was never a big crystal guy. And, um, you know, then I realized like on a scientific level what they're actually doing. And um, they're actually changing the frequency around you. Like they're disrupting. And by doing that, they're disrupting the patterns that you are stuck in. Um, because, you know, the, the patterns we're stuck in have, have a certain frequency that they're emanating or they're emitting from our bodies and our hearts all the time. And crystals, what they do is if you allow them in, their, in your field, they, their, their energetic pattern, their frequency is so powerful that it actually will disrupt yours um, and bring it higher or train, change it or transform it or just allow you to, to feel or see something in a different way or open the door to something different, a new possibility. So I always like having them with my breathwork sessions because again, they open the doorway to uh, feeling and seeing things from different perspectives that I normally wouldn't see them as. So, and I've got an ant on my, I think that's an ant. I don't know if you guys can see that. Yeah, there he is. Ants wanted to go for, along for the ride. All right, guys, hope you enjoyed. Let me know what you think. Um, and, uh, I'll see you next time.